Good day, viewers. Welcome to this live broadcast, and I welcome you wherever you're joining us from today. We're here at an unknown, an unknown location with Miss KT. Those of you who know the, the situation surrounding Miss KT here, she was seen on a surveillance video jumping out of a window and running like a track star after this the police would have been summoned to her location which was a popular guest house where the body of an elderly man was found deceased on top of a toilet bowl miss katie could you say when exactly was this incident well this incident happened last week friday freaky friday okay viewers that was last friday yes um could you tell us how long you and this individual have been associated? Well, we, we did it together for about four years. So could you walk us through exactly what perspired, I mean, transpired Friday last? Well, he's either pick me up or I's meet either. And when he go, he's usually go right to the receptionist and order the usual. And, and what exactly is the usual? He's usually order three bears and two Guinness. The, the bears are for you? Yes, because, you know, I, Guinness too bitter for me. I don't really like, I don't really like Guinness. Okay, um, so after, after you, you would have gotten the, the round, you went upstairs and, and what next? Well, you know, me and he, we like do a little thing, right? So we sit down and we have a normal gaff and so we sit down and then we, we get into each other's space and we do a nice little role playing and so he gonna be cat man, I gonna be cat woman, he gonna be Timon, I gonna be the juicy pumba. And one, two, three, we get into each other and then lashing start. So um, could, you, could you give us like an average on how long does the lashing normally last? Well, it, it does last normally two minutes and 36 seconds, 37 if you're really feeling it. So, um, after you guys would have lashed, what happened next? Uh, your girl got to keep herself clean, so I went in and bathed, and he went outside waiting on me. So, why, why was he waiting outside? Didn't you want him to join you in the shower? Them guess how soap small. They only get what well, is like the size of this. So we we can't really share the soap, so it gotta be one after the other. I see. So after you would have finished showering, what happened next? Well, I come out and then he go in. So I the outside, the island, my little body, listening to my little music, and then all I hear is boom, boom, pop, pop. <laughs> fell. And then I rush inside, I wanna know what what happened and what's going on. I see the man face on the table. <laughs> So, so, um, could you explain to me after you found them doing? <laughs> no, 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 Travis, it's not that. It's <laughs> <laughs> good. So after you found them out of breath like that, what did you do next? Oh, what, what else your girl gonna do? I put on my bra, put on my pants, and I run. I run downstairs to the receptionist, and both we come back upstairs, and we see the man lying on there. You see, my, my neighbor husband lying on there in front of me, and she says she want to call the police and the ambulance, and you know what? I jumped through the window. So, could, could you explain to us why is it that you felt that you needed to jump through the window and run away? Are you a runner or a track star? Are you an athlete? Do you have history in at athleticism? Well, I am versed in athletes. Plus, usually when the, me and the man don't lash, he's paid for the wrong and he's paid for the room, but he dead. So he would, he would not be able to pay and I can't put it on a dead man. Plus, he's my neighbor husband. I didn't want to catch me in the room. Could you tell us what is the specific reason that you decided to come live with me here today to conduct this interview? Because, um, as you know, there are a lot of rumors going around about you and also a lot of memes and stickers were made in WhatsApp groups and these kind of stuff. Could you tell us why you decided to conduct this interview? 
Well, uh, as you said, because of all the rumors, the rumors going around the place got me looking bad, saying that I stab up the man in his chest, I throw the man out the window, I take a knife and cut off his toes. All of it is lies in all, and they're telling lies in me. The okay. only thing that is true, Tavis, is that I got the grippy. I am Miss Grippy. This is what he used to call me, and he know that I got it. Clink, clink. Okay, Miss Grippy. Well, you guys heard it here first. Um, so are you going to now turn yourself into the police or are you going to continue be or are you going to continue in hiding? I will turn myself over to the police and uh -huh. I just want the people who are saying a bunch of lies pelting on my grandmother house to stop it. Wait for the autopsy and then you will have peace. Okay, well you guys heard it here first from Ms. Grippy. She appears to be innocent. Now we'll have a word from the deceased. Over to you. So you would have just heard an exclusive interview from Miss KT. Now we have here with us, I must thank you, sir. We have with us here the deceased. I had to pull some strings and make some calls to the bigger ones up above to present us today with this interview. Sir, could you tell us your side of the story that occurred at the local guest house with Miss KT? Well, first of all, to all the viewers, I just like to say YOLO. You only live once, life short, life sweet, so enjoy it to the max. You see how I did? I did nice, buddy. Couldn't ask for a better one. Anyways, so. Could you tell us your relationship to the, um, the young lady, Miss KT? Oh, my little skin? Oh, she got like cooked food. There's me, Shati. I'm going to roll up one or two times, rack it up, knock it up, jack it up, and then you know, sometimes it's got to cock it up, but. I think I went a little too rash, I went into fifth gear and then, you know, the vehicle broke down, so <laughs> it is where it is. So, um, according to the, the um, autopsy that was done on your body, that um, they said that your, the cause of death was heart attack. Could you shed some light on, on that? Oh, bye. If I only tell you, me heart more than attack me by. If you see the grip, oh my God. God, there's one for the century, my guy. Oh my gosh. Hey, I tell you, ain't nothing, nothing sweeter. Nothing sweeter. You hear what I'm telling you? That top C is your top C of the year. Yeah, buddy. Okay, the, the, um, <clears throat> could, you, could you tell us what was going through your mind the, the last few seconds just before you, you left the face of the earth? Well, first of all, it might be a bit disturbing to some persons, but the only thing that was going through my mind was, I will get take your time, me just grip. My girl, take your time, me just grip. <laughs> take your time, funny thing, me just grip. Oh my gosh! Me just grip, me just grip me. I said she grip me. I said she, oh, oh my God. It was wonderful. Well, you guys heard it here first. Um, this is the deceased giving us some light on his side of the story. Thank you for joining us. I am Tavis Wiesline, reporting for Facebook News.